lose nothing by giving them the, the benefit of the doubt. You can still be firm. You can still be direct. So if somebody is attacking my idea in the meet in a meeting, I'm pitching my idea and somebody's bringing up past mistakes and they're trying to undermine me. I can assume they're a jerk and this is a political play and they're trying to make me look bad, in which case I will attack them back and they'll get defensive. Or I can assume that they're stressed, they're frustrated. Maybe they don't understand where I'm coming from. Maybe they see what I'm doing as a threat to them and I need to try to understand where they're coming from. So I'm gonna soften my voice. I'm gonna get a little goofy grin. I'm gonna say, Charles, help me out here. You seem to have some concerns about this. Uh, why is it you're so worried about how we're doing this? And I'm going to listen and I'm going to understand. I don't lose any options by taking the moment to be respectful. If you're still being difficult and argumentative, I can then say, you know what, Charles, I hate to say it, but I get the feeling like you just don't like this idea because it's not centered in your area. I can still say whatever I said before. I can still be as firm as I was before. I could still say, I'm sorry you don't like it, but it's the direction we're going to go. So I can be just as firm, but everybody in the room, including you, will see how respectful I was in the process, and that never hurts. 